BKFC is in Albuquerque. We are here with Kai Stewart at Knuckle Mania 3, the number one ranked 145 pound fighter on the BKFC roster, sitting there with a 3 0 record. Dude, what are you doing down here? Just enjoying the festivities? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, Thursday, I was just chilling at home. The weekly bus, they hit me up and they were like, yo, you got, like, why aren't you down here? I was like, my, uh, the person I was going to drive with bailed, so I looked online, the flights were there. I was like, fuck it, we're going to Knuckle Mania. So. Well, this is a show that you shouldn't miss, yeah, especially yeah. being ranked number one in your division. You want to be out there, you want to be seen, you want to get known by the crowd, by, by the audience and the owners. When are we going to see you back in the squared circle? It's been a minute. Yeah, we're. Uh, I think I have a conversation next week to figure that out. I'm, I'm hoping to get back in there as soon as possible. I have some things i got to take care of, so that April card looks really good, and I'd love to be a part of it. You're still competing in college as well? Uh, no, uh -uh. I, whenever I became pro, I found out that I had to uh, put wrestling behind me, which hurts a little bit, but I get to beat people up for money now. So it's we, we, we were wondering that when you came on the show, we asked you, uh, you could do that? We didn't even know that was even possible, but you just answered that question. Now, we just saw H.D. Davis walk by. You guys got to take a good look at each other. Um, who is an opponent that you have in mind that have they offered you anybody yeah in reality uh, I'm number one at a vacant weight so I, I think no matter who I fight needs to be for a belt if they if I can't sneak a belt in there I want a UFC fighter I want an ex UFC fighter in reality I, I think Louis and uh, Howard should run it back in the winter that gets me for a world title I would love to see you fight either one of those guys dude you're here you're in the house you're one of the biggest up, upcoming stars for the BKFC, but you're sitting amongst the stars tonight. You got John Jones sitting 10 feet from you over there. You got Mike Perry in the house. How awesome is this? You know, it's kind of surreal. Like, I released a diss track, and one of the um, lines in there was, I saw my name up in the stars right after I became ranked, and, and that now my dreams are coming to reality, but we're not done yet. Have you got to meet any of these guys yet? So I've been kind of taking it easy. I met Carlos Condit, a super nice guy sitting right next to him, actually. And then John Jones, I'm giving him some space, but I'm definitely going to have to work my way in there. A little starstruck, not even going to lie. He's the greatest of all time. It's good to see him in the house, Knucklemania 3. Let's get him a fight, get him back in there. You got any final words for anybody that wants to listen? Well, like always, Native Grown, you guys are my boys back home in Montana. Other than that, I just can't wait to get back in there and scrap again. Another sharp-dressed, bare-knuckle fighter here. I'll tell you right now, of all the combat sports, we got the best style. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. <laughs> mustaches, mustaches and suits. Let's go. That's right. Kai Stewart in the house. Knucklemania 3. Let's go. Thank you, guys.